Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm just going to get right into it. Um, this is for the sign of Gemini. Gemini, thank you guys and welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys for all that you do on my channel. If you would like a reading, look down in my description box. Guys, I'm trying to get all these weekly readings out because of the holidays. I've been very busy. I am a one-man show. <laughs> and again, thank you guys for your likes, shares, and subscribe. And make sure you donate to Empress Shay Shay. How about that? Okay, here we go, Gemini. Gemini, what I feel, this Gemini that I'm picking up the energy on, this Gemini has a has a very good heart, has a very big heart. Everybody's not going the same place you're going, Gemini. This is the energy that I'm getting. You're trying to make a move, but you're trying to help everybody and tag everybody, tag everybody in. You can't do that. Because everybody's not meant to go where you are going. It's not their life purpose or it's not their time or however it may be this is what i'm getting okay this card says not unsuccessful plans this is what i just told you whatever you're planning it's going to be very uns unsuccessful because your exciting event look at this gone exciting event okay you have something exciting about to happen in your life gemini but again it is for your life solo dolo it's not for everybody else you are actually addicted to helping others, family and friends, and trying to resolve things for everybody. You can't do that with everybody. Jealousy is a motherfucker. I'm just going to tell you that, Gemini. And this is for my Geminis. It could just be a Gemini sun, sun, sun moon rising of Venus, or you may have Gemini in your chart. General reading, take it how it resonates, guys. Okay, this is what... Y'all, please ignore the noise outside. I'm, I'm Oh, man, it's the holidays. <laughs> I, um, when I moved in here last year, it was around, um, it was after, I think it was after the holidays, so I didn't really pay attention to all the noise, but anywho, this is what's going on, oh my goodness, this is very, look at this, see this Gemini, I cannot, I should end the reading right here, you are in, you are thinking, look at her, you're standing, you're waiting, and you're thinking, because you know what? What did the universe say? You have an exciting event that's coming up. You getting ready. Look at this. That's 1111. That's my 11. That's my true love card. Four ones, 1111. You have a soulmate, a true love that you're about to make an offer to. But you are sitting here thinking about what the fuck everybody else is going to say. This is crazy ass shit. This is what I'm saying. You, you got to stop. This is earth energy. Um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and this is um, Aries, Sagittarius, and Leo. Guys, I'm going to tell you something. You, you got to live your own life. You know, you you, you want to make an offer to your true love, but you're afraid of what other people think. Come on now. You're sitting back fantasizing. You're sitting back thinking of all the good times you have with this person. You're trying to figure out why do I connect so much with this person, never connected with so many different people in my life. You want to reach out to this person, but you you kind of, I don't know if you're kind of shy or you just, look at this. You hiding this person. You hiding this queen of wands from everybody. You hiding it from your family, friends, your people in your circle, your job, whatever. Take it how it resonates. This is a very, this is my witchy card, okay? This person is very beautiful. This person may have a black cat, um, some type of black animal. This person is um, just all put together, beautiful, everything you want. But you're hiding this person. And you're hiding this person and you're making this person feel like a misfit. Like, why are you hiding this person? Okay? And this person is feel, either you hiding the person, the person hiding you, or y'all hiding both of you. I don't fucking know. But y'all meet up at night in secret. And then you're hiding this person. Okay? You're, you, 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 you're in balance. Everything is out of balance. This whole relationship is out of balance. And it's out of balance because what? Because you will not bring this into balance. But you sitting up thinking about this person day and night. And you know this is your true love. You know you guys were meant to be together. But you rather walk away... And let both of you guys suffer and be in pain because both of you guys are mirroring each other, okay? Rather than 
trying to sever the relationship or come together with this person. Look at this. But the Holy Spirit says there will be a new beginning. The universe says there will be a, a new beginning regardless. You're, you will communicate. You're trying to communicate. You're trying to come in very fast. But you have to push all these negative people away from you, all these fucking toxic ass people. And it's time to walk away. No matter, you may say, I can't walk away from family. I can't walk away from friends. But the universe is edging you to do this because these people are, no longer serves you. They no longer serve you at all. Okay? It's time to move to calmer waters. Okay? This, this queen of wands, they're telling you this person don't want you. This person is a bitch. This person um, stand her ground. This per Quit listening to other people. Quit listening to others. See this, this card? You listen to other people. Page of Cups. I have water energy. I have um, um, air energy. I have um, Scorpio energy. And I have earth energy. It's time to move forward. It doesn't make sense. Look at this. King of Wands came out. You guys are supposed to be married. You guys were supposed to be married. Look at this. Look at look look at the Holy Spirit. Look at the Holy Spirit work. I'm gonna show you how the Holy Spirit works. Look at these cards. I cannot make this shit up if I fucking try. Look at this. This is the King of Wands and the Queen of Wands. You guys are supposed to be married. This is a very passionate connection. And you want to have sex with this person. Because you have passionate sex with this person. Sex like no other. And it's not just about sex. But you're supposed to be married to this person. Because this is your true love. So what the fuck are you all in your head for? Look at how you are every night all day long. And then you sitting up thinking about this person when you by yourself. But yet, you want to walk away from this person right here instead of moving to calmer waters or instead of going to see this person. Because you know when you communicate with this person, this person is going to communicate back with you. Okay? But you instead of allowing other people to gossip about this person and you just sit there and walk away like you don't know this person. But you instead of want to make an offer to this person. But then you in secret letting everybody else fuck over this person because you need to bring this into balance okay and stop pushing this person away okay i cannot because you and this person is heartbroken guys there's nothing else i can say it's nothing else i could say this is it gemini you guys have a good day. Light and love.